Here's a quick look at the tools you'll need to complete the job. RJ45 cable tool, category 5, 5E or 6 cable, RJ45 connectors, and optionally, scissors and a cable tester. Start by measuring out and cutting the length of cable you need. Strip the outer jacket of the cable with the cable tool. This particular tool has a pre-measured stripping distance. Yours may not, in which case you'll want to strip off only about half inch of the jacket or so. Once you've stripped the jacket off, sort the eight wires accordingly. Orange striped, orange, green striped, blue, blue striped, green, brown striped, brown. Trim any excess insulation off with the scissors. Bunch the wires, being careful to keep them in order. Place the RJ45 connector over the wires, allowing it to space the wires evenly. Remove the end and trim the wires so that they're of an even length. If you do not do this, chances of making a clean connection with all the pins of the connector are greatly decreased. Place the RJ45 connector back over the wires so that the colors are visible through the side without the latch. Do one last check to be sure the wires are all still in order. Orange stripe, orange, green stripe, blue, blue stripe, green, brown stripe, brown. Once you're certain the order is correct, place the connector back over the wires and using the crimper tool, clamp down tightly so that the connector pins pierce the wires completely. Inspect the newly crimped end to ensure a complete and tight connection. Be sure you can't pull the end off again. Repeat the same process for the other end. If you have a cable tester, attach the ends to it and verify a solid connection light on all wires. If the connection is bad, simply remove the ends and repeat the process.